Alright, hello. Welcome to American Truck Simulator. We've got to start up another company. Right, I think this person looks the closest to me. Yeah, that's me, definitely. Please enter the name of your company. Unfortunately, Big Bum Trucking went under. But don't worry, we're gonna build a new company and it's gonna be better because it's in America where everything's bigger. There we go, giant bum trucking. Uh, this all looks good, English, yes, uh, create. I've made a new company, what could possibly go wrong? Right, have we already got a business thing going on? Am I already meant to do something? I didn't even get to choose a job, what the hell? Right, off we go on my journey through America. So in America they drive on the right. Got to, oh, I've already driven on the left. Oh, very hilly in San Fr Why did I choose San Francisco to be my bait? It's like the hilliest city in America. Uh, is that a red light for me? I don't know how American roads work. <laughs> oh, is that green for me? It might be for me. That might be for me. I'm off. Hello, bus. Oh, a tram. Oh, they've got that detail very well. Look at that tram. Never actually been on a tram, not even like the London trams. I didn't even know London even had trams until like a few years ago when one of them crashed. Naughty man. I would never crash a tram. tram simulator when you need it? Right, let's go up on here. I'm sure this is part of the road, isn't it? This is perfectly legal. Oh, ooh, I think that was almost red. I think that was orange. <laughs> oh, is that a red light? No, that's for the future. It's hard to tell. Oh, these roads are very confusing. It's green! I'm definitely breaking the speed limit, but luckily there's no police in America. The police won't catch me in America. They're all too stupid and eating donuts. Right, this looks like a bit of a turn-in. I think it's a green light, though. Whee! Oh, I'm, I'm going on head on to traffic. Ah, well, America seems nice. Looks like some kind of car dealership. I don't think I was even meant to come in this way. <laughs> I've just gone in the wrong way, but oh well. We're, we're getting there. It's me and truck sim. What could possibly go wrong? Hello. Where do you want the truck, sir? Oh. I accidentally skipped that by mistake. Oh well. Right, I think I've found a job. We're delivering office supplies from Phoenix, Arizona to the Grand Canyon. We get to visit the is the Grand Canyon in the game. Well, that'd be pretty cool if it is. Right here we go then. Job number one. What could possibly go wrong? We're going to the Grand Canyon and we're starting here in Arizona. Arizona looks lovely. Oh, there's actually people in this game. Oh, let's hope I don't run anyone over. How's it going, sir? Oh, you're behind this barrier, but that won't stop me. <laughs> <laughs> That's very naughty. Can I run you over, sir? Well, you're in a very hard place to hit. Dun, dun, dun. Are you going to move? <laughs> He's not moving. Hello. <laughs> oh. I can't seem to run him over. He's just too strong. Damn it. You win this time, sir. Right. Anyway, I guess I'll just go through this fence. Seems like the thing to do. Good driving already. People who appreciate my good driving. I'm a very, very well-behaved driver. Right, here we go then. Off we go. Ah, oh, look at all this lovely sun. It's not like Euro Truck Simulator where it rains all the time. Hold on, there are just like people. This is just like pedestrians. This is all wet. This is already way better than Euro Truck Simulator. Although maybe they're not on like the main path, or else you just run them over all the time. Knowing me, I'd do that all the time. So yeah, America looks nice. Looks very hot. Do I get to turn? No, it's a stop sign. I don't really understand how stop signs work. I'm just going to go through it. That seems like the right idea. Right, I don't know much about America. I'm going to go get me some burgers and some hookers. That's what they like in America, isn't it? Oh no, stereotypes. Deary me. I kept getting caught for speeding in Euro Truck Sim, but maybe there's less speed cameras. I hope there's less speed cameras, then I could be naughty. There's also a cloud in the sky. It's going to be a lovely road trip where nothing bad happens at all. I'm actually going to take this very seriously. 
apart from when I tried to run over that man earlier, but apart from that very serious driving. Oh, slow down, sir. I think my truck can only go 50. Now, this is just going to be very relaxed, and no one, I'm not even going to crash at 50 miles per hour, am I? Is there any traffic? Oh, there's a truck there. I'm going to block him off. No, you're not overtaking me, sir. No. Right, eyes on the road. I mean, very deserty, isn't it, around here? Very deserty. Wish it was deserty. I prefer dessert over desert. In real life, I would actually love to do a road trip for America, though, because there's so many states you can go through, and there's so much variety in the you know, types of weather, the types of. Um, environment through all American you get snow there's forests there's deserts all kinds of stuff I mean if you do a road trip through Britain it's basically just shit holes and more shit holes and more shit holes and a few trees and that's about it America's so vast and massive like that people oh no I'm so sorry Americans you know I'm kidding around Great Britain are fat as well dear me I should stop being offensive but that's what truck drivers are like. Oh no, now I've offended truck drivers. Oh, dearie me. <laughs> Do I just stay on the motorway the entire time? This might be a bit boring. Can I cut across the desert? There we go. Let's cut across the desert. We've gone off road. That's what trucks are made for. We're going off road. Da 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 Shortcut. Woo! <laughs> that was a bit of a jump. There we go. I found a new shortcut. Oh, I'm getting overtaken. Oh, oh, you... No, that's not a very good horn. I was expecting a big, massive... Boop! Out why bitch, I'm in America! Beep, beep. I'm not breaking any laws so far. I don't think I've broken any laws so far. It's all going very well. So, so far, this compared to Euro Truck Simulator, it's very similar in the way that it controls, but you can tell it's a newer game. It does look a little bit better. There's little bits of improvements here and there, there's a li little bit more detail and I'm enjoying it so far I mean I know Europe better because you know I live in Europe but there's a few states I know in America although it's so vast it's gonna be hard to make the entire America, maybe with DLCs and stuff because I mean California by itself is probably bit bigger than Britain, I think Texas definitely is I mean, you'd think Texas would be in the game, but maybe they're making it all on like the west coast and they're maybe making their way eastwards. Otherwise, Texas would be the obvious choice because that's where a lot of trucks are. Oh, someone's been pulled over by the police. Naughty man. I would never get pulled over by the police. Oi! Beep, beep. Madam in the red car, right, I'm overtaking you around here. Oh, what a lovely overtaking maneuver. Ha ha! I'm a great truck driver. Crash at what? There was no such thing. Maybe the back of my trailer hit them, but that was their fault if they hit my trailer, surely. That was not my fault. I don't think this is the longest journey either. It says 1 hour 38 minutes. That's not too far to get to the Grand Canyon. One one of the wonders of the world. Is it one of the wonders of the world? I know like the pyramids is. I would have thought the Grand Canyon would be one of the wonders of the world, but I don't think it counts as one. Probably because it's American, it's like meant to be like brand new or something. Because pretty much everything in America is brand new. Because it was only recently discovered, you see. How far over the speed limit do you have to be before you're actually speeding? Because obviously you're allowed like a couple miles an hour over the speed limit and it's not speeding. I think it's, if it's like five or more miles per hour over the speed limit, maybe then that's speeding. Alright, looks like we're going through a little town. Lovely, I'm not sure what this place is called. I'm gonna call it Shitsville. No, oh, Flagstaff. Flagstaff, aka Shitsville. Is Flagstaff a real city or town? Hello, anyone from Flagstaff that might be watching this video? There's probably none of you. I don't have many viewers from Flagstaff. Right, oh, Grand Canyon that way. Lovely, right. Hello, traffic. You don't mind if I overtake you? Oh, speed and offence. Oh, red lights. Oh, I've broken all the I've broken all the laws now. I don't know how American roads work at all. <gasps> oh, what a motel! Oh, let's stop by here and get some hookers. Lovely. What's going on there? Naughtiness. What about 
Builder Simulator. Bob the Builder, can he fix it? Bob the Builder, no he can't. Oh, looks like I see another naughty shortcut. Lovely. Can I go through this bush? Is that a strong bush? <laughs> oh, that tree might be... No, I can just go through that tree. That's lucky. Sometimes in video games you can never tell if a tree is solid or if a bush is solid or not. You get really strong bushes in some games and you just can't drive through them. But that bush was weak. That was lucky. I'm finding plenty of shortcuts. This delivery is going to be... A new speed record. The fastest delivery in America. In your face, IPS. Is IPS a delivery in America? I don't know. Top 10 national parks. Of course, there's um, Yellowstone Park, which may have a giant volcano underneath. And if that giant volcano goes off, we're all screwed. So let's hope it, it doesn't become naughty and blow up. No one set off that volcano. I mean, I'm not too worried about it, because I think they can monitor these volcanoes, but the problem is, there's nothing you could do. You can't really stop a massive, giant volcano from going off. You can't go, oh, we'll just put a plug in it and stop it from exploding. Or erupting is the specific word you should say. Oh, that would have a stop sign. I don't really understand those. <laughs> I don't understand stop signs, so I'm just ignoring them. Oh! Is that a hot, hot dog? Oh. Oh, yeah, UPS. That's a delivery system. That's the one I was thinking about. Not IPS. UPS. I mean, it says UDS. I guess because of copyright, you can't actually call it IPS. Because that looks very similar. <laughs> Is that some donuts? Oh, there's donuts as well. What do you want? Donuts or hot dogs, everyone? What's better? Hot dogs or donuts? Oh, a fellow truck. Hello, sir. Oh, I've got a truck behind me as well. Oh, I think I've just gone off the road. All right, we're definitely in the middle of nowhere now. On the way... To Is the Grand Canyon actually going to be in the game? Will you actually be able to see the Grand Canyon? Because I'm going to be very disappointed if the Grand Canyon looks just like nothing. I know in Euro Truck Sim there wasn't very many actual landmarks. It basically, like every town would look exactly the same. There wasn't like there wasn't even like a Big Ben or something. Oh, are we gonna see the Grand Canyon or are we gonna be disappointed? I have a feeling. Oh wait, can I crash into the Grand Canyon? Oh please, I can crash into the Grand Canyon. I bet it can't. Grand Canyon Village discovered. Hmm, I don't see any Grand Canyons. I see a helicopter in the sky. Right, well this is where you're going to stop off. I'm going to just investigate first. Because I don't see any Grand Canyons. Where's this Grand Canyon? I don't see... Oh, it's over there. Oh, it's probably behind that fence, isn't it? It's probably... I reckon that's where it is. Oh, no, there it is. <laughs> is that right in front of my face? Oh, there it is. It's like, oh, where's the Grand Canyon? Oh, it's right there. It's very... Not very well rendered Grand Canyon. That's basically like a 2D picture of a Grand Canyon. But at least it's in the game. At least I'd put it in the game. See if I can get a closer look around here. It's nice it's in the game. I think you could get a better look around here. Oh, it's a very tight squeeze, though. Oh, yeah, this is a good viewpoint. Trailer damage... Oh, yeah, it's a bit too tight. Also, hopefully that helicopter doesn't crash. Oh, there we go. A nice romantic viewing spot. There we go. The Grand Canyon. Oh, I don't think I can drive into it, though. Oh, no. <laughs> Definitely can't drive into it. Oh, there's even a little river down there as well. Ooh. What's the name of that? Da Is it the Hoover Dam? In the... Um, Grand oh, my God. That helicopter's getting a bit close. Careful. I don't want to crash your helicopter. Yeah, it's the Hoover Dam in the Grand Canyon, isn't it? You're learning all kinds of things if you didn't know that, if that's a real fact. I might have just made that fact up. Right, let's actually drop off my delivery and finish this video. What a lovely journey to the Grand Canyon. It oh, I've done damage more of my trailer on that silly wall. Why aren't these roads designed for these trucks? They're too small. I should know everything's bigger in America, including my big bum. My bum's even bigger in America. Right, so here we are. Here's a drop-off point. Very successful. Not much damage. A lovely job well done. 
apart from I've still got to park the trailer, which is my my least favourite thing about the game is parking the trailer. I'm always very bad at it. Right, here we are then. We are here. I'm in. Oh, I think I'm fully in though. I'm almost in. I think I'm in. I'm in. I've got it in. There we go. Excellent. That was apparently excellent driving. Time taken 4 hours 19 minutes. So there we go. A successful journey. Successful delivery. We even saw the Grand Canyon. Thank you everyone for watching. Take care and I'll see you around. Now leave me alone.